The internet has made a lot of things easier. Murder just may be one of them. 19-year-old Taylor Clark was on a roll. Done with his college finals, he'd already paid for his next semester in full. He had a cool car, and he wanted to sell it on Craigslist. According to police, that's where he met 24-year-old Michael Gordon. Police say the two agreed to meet during lunch Monday at Gordon's work, a truck driver training school, to look the car over. Monday night, Clark's family reported the college sophomore missing, and the next day, police found his car still parked at the truck driving school and his body in some nearby brush. Taylor was shot one time. It was so convenient, according to investigators. Meet online, murder over lunch. But convenience cuts both ways. Police say the internet quickly led them to Clark's alleged killer. The victim and the suspect did connect uh, through Craigslist. Gordon's been charged with first degree murder and assault. The case is not the only recent example of violent crime allegedly connected to Craigslist. She cut me. Who cut you? Um, I don't know. One of the most horrific happened this past March in Colorado when a woman seven months pregnant responded to an ad for baby clothes on Craigslist. She was attacked, police say, by 34-year-old Dinell Lane, who they say stabbed the mother-to-be and cut her unborn child from her body. The mother survived. Her baby did not. And there's this man who authorities in Georgia say lured in a suburban Atlanta couple by advertising a 1966 Mustang on Craigslist. Instead of their dream car, police say all the couple got was killed. In both of these cases, the accused have yet to be arraigned. Craigslist turns 20 this year. The company reports more than 60 million people use the web service every month in the U.S. alone. And Craigslist says the incidence of violent crime is extremely low. The site offers a link to safety tips for buyers and sellers. Reports of crime in Craigslist may bother some, but police doubt it will stop many from using the service. It's just too convenient.